Let's converse for a second, everybody. What is going on? It's your guy, Senpai Rai. And today... Okay, we're talking already. We're conversing, woman. Oh, you think that's adorable. Well, I think that cute little teehee laugh of yours is also very adorable, Mrs. But in the meantime, this is an RHD run of tier 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, and 39 bosses only. And I will show you the teams, how they're lay laid out, and also, this video takes place over the course of about four days, and at the end of this video, I will officially be on tier 40 whenever I drop this video. Now, I may be on a higher tier within 45 minutes of me dropping this video, just like the last RHD run, but we have no idea what the future holds. So let's begin, everybody. <laughs> Happy guy. Alrighty, tier 35. Let's go. Let's make this segment bosses only. Because last time I did an RHD run, I think I cleared... What? All the way up to the boss on tier 35? And as you see, with the average being 35 and I have two level 30s, this girl and this weak character, because yellow is the weak element, Jin Toki, you are the saving grace of this team. That's how he's dressed, this is how Elizabeth is dressed, and of course, this is how weak Mr. Bogard is dressed. Because again, yellow is the weak element for this boss. And I believe the boss is the girl with horns all the way on the right side, the one with a ninja mask. <laughs> oh, I love it. She looks like an avatar for Final Fantasy XIV. She really does. But this isn't that game. This is the portion of KOFAS where we revive Hell's Dungeon. Because it is Hell. Because it's annoying as shit. And they only have two variants of the stage. So it can get very repetitious at times. So we're going to roll skill 1. Bounce you up. Skill 2. Catch you with a hold skill with burst. Bleed damage. Skill 3. Hide behind my super armor. Switch and Mr. Bow Guard do the damn thing with your weak self. Okay, Liz. Take over, Liz. That didn't seem like it went very well. Catch you, Liz. Ooh, here we go. Here we go. Getting stunned up. Come on, Jintoki. Come on, Jintoki. Okay, good. I was waiting for Jintoki, but I was able to actually get three tiers, so let me just do a little bit more DPS. Because this type of stage, you see the skeleton meter at the top? It's literally on just as much damage as you can pump out as quickly as possible. That is the objective of this type of stage. And here we go. Oh my god, they're abusing my Liz. She's not having a very Merry Christmas at that point. So let me go through my 1, 2, 3. Because that's how easy it is sometimes. It's as easy as 1, 2, 3, Miss Electro. Ah, okay. Let's play. Let me get you on the left side because it's much better footage to see you getting the shit comboed out of you on the left side than hiding behind my active skills on my right side. Let's go with Jin Toki. It's three tier right this second, and heads will roll, apparently. So it's one, two, wait for it, and three at about the time of your super armor running out, and three tier traditional RN. Now, let's see. Let's. Oh, Lord. Okay. But I hit skill one where I was damaging into that one. Let's cluster all my skill sets right now. And again, you guys, I don't really play too much RHD on camera, so if I'm going to do a bosses only bout, it's going to probably take place over the next few days to a week or so, that way I can just compound boss fights while I chop them up in a cat food with Jin Toki. Well, at least that's the plan, but she has just about 25 times health bars, and Jin Toki is about spent, and again, he was the saving grace of this team. But... You know me. I'll muscle through one way or another. Now, this was a problem for me. I could have picked a ton of other units. I could have. But none of them would be more level. Because one of the requirements for this boss was a balanced team. And 
Believe it or not, this is the strongest balanced team that I have at my disposal. Now, if they were to say, oh, attack team, oh, defense team, like they have so many times in the past, uh, stick a fork in it because it's donezo at that point. Now, Mr. Bogard, time to shine like no other. Now, his Buster Wolf 3 tier. Oh! What it does is gives him an extra 20% active skill damage, and you saw where I used it and then popped wings, so I'm getting an additional 20% damage off of my actives to kind of counter him being a weak element in this run. But essentially, this is the exact same tier I said I was doing the other day, where I got up to the boss. And again, the reason I haven't really leveled up a bunch of balance fighters is realistically, at this point, Jintoki is the only one that I actually use on a colored team so it's completely fine even if um the all-star mr jintoki himself is dead and liz is pretty much dead so i guess you're gonna have to be the saving grace for this video terry come on let's show them what my favorite character in the franchise can do as a weak element <laughs> oh lord i'm glad i had my skill one she was about to do something i saw some kind of countdown see People are so serious. I mean, take a page out of Terry's book. I mean, he, he goes and burns. <laughs> Every now and then it's time to go burn, apparently, according to Terry. <laughs> oh my god, that one hit almost melted my entire health. Okay, pop you up with skill three, hit you with another three tier buster. Wolf, gotta take this seriously because it's getting to be about that time. <sighs> Woo! Six seconds left, beating you with your weak, or your strong, your weak element. He's your weak element, absolutely. No, he's your, yeah, he's your weak element. He is not the strong element. He is the weak element. Okay. So, balance only team tier 35 cleared. Let's jump right in to tier 36 right this second. Come on, everybody. Anybody up for tier 36? Well, not the whole tier, just the boss stage, as you guys remember. And as you see, everybody is still the same because they're tormenting me with this balance-only team BS, where Jintoki has to actually be the saving grace, because all these are my balance. And again, I have a weakened unit. But this time, instead of Jintoki League, I'm using Liz, because she gives an increase in balance type fighters attack by 30, and a nice crit rate boost. But we still have pretty much the exact same team, just with a different leader. Because this game hates me. If you were to give me an attack team, or a defense team standard, I would just melt through this RHD stage. But no, y'all want to constantly troll me with balance type fighters when I roll and hit my hyper armor because I hate the robots. Out of all the other ads they could give us, I hate the robots the most because after they hit you, they stun you and they hold you in place. Where you have to use an emergency dodge or a forward pushing super hyper armor skill, it, it gets a little bit aggravating, everybody. But on a lighter note, I did order a costume for Halloween today and in the next few days after it comes in what I'm probably going to do is uh, throw down some kind of a Halloween special to where I do an unboxing of my costume because it is about that time of season everybody my favorite holiday Halloween so let's roll to the right and catch everybody with a super move Jintoki all right, Mr. Bogard, show him how to shine, buddy. There you go. Roll, three tier. That way I get my 20% active skill bonus. As y'all remember, skill three right. Oh, no skill three. How about that? <laughs> Big boss man, let's go. Now I hit skill. Jesus, I'm getting comboed. My skill two wasn't enough to save me from getting comboed, but it gave me damage immunity. So let's shine right now, Liz. Try to get you the five tier. God, you made me do this to you. You made me do this. Uh, just because of the fact that I don't know what kind of special attack moves you have, Mr. Random Boss. I do know that Liz is your weak element. You see the blue numbers. But at the same time, I think I'll be able to pull this one off. And again, everybody, this video, along with the last tier RHD, is being filmed the same night I dropped the video on RHD tier 34 clear. 
So, everybody thinks I'm still on 34. Let's see if I can get at least up to 37 tonight. <laughs> uh, senpai, sometimes you are a Decepticon. Oh, shison. I completely with that one. Roll up two. And we go three. Catch you. And three to you right now. Okay. So, out of curiosity, Ryan, what RHD stage are you really on? Oh, you guys. A magician never reveals all his tricks. I think it's more fun that way. Isn't it more fun not knowing what my complete account holds? I mean, the, inf the information I give is genuine. The play style and how to play videos are genuine. My pull videos are ridiculously ridiculous in the best ways. So, um, again, what tier are you on? What kind of job you do besides content creating? What's your social security number, Ryan? Give us all this information right now. Uh, love of life is so real. All right, here we go, Buster Wolf, right now. Gotcha. Skill one. Gotcha. And just spam you. Oh my god, that wasted a good maybe three... Maybe more than three seconds if you were able to kill Terry. Okay, we got a, just over ten racks of health left. Let me work some magic. And we still have 15 seconds with Jim Toki. Gonna get all actives. Three tier right now. And this should be a long three tier as everybody knows. My skill should be reset. I'm gonna probably hit you with a one, two, three. And then your traditional three tier after this beheading right this second. Ready? One, two, three. Can't waste it. Hell with it. Can't waste it. Can't waste it. I'll save it as an active because it's much short. Okay, I have my wings. Good deal. Good deal. Good deal. It's going to be so close. Gotcha. Uh, and Jin Toki saves the day. Would it be the first time, sir? Old stoic-faced Jin Toki. Uh... I bet you he would make that same face if you said that somebody shot, like, his pet cat or his dog or something, you know? He's like, oh, okay, whatever. Stoic face in Tokyo. <laughs> okay, tier 37. Let's keep moving. Tier 37, and check this out. Defense type fighters. Average level 37. You done goofed up. <laughs> Game. That's all I have to say because all of my defense types are five star at least level 43 <laughs> I have lady big as the lead because she gives a nice defense boost But check this out. I have all my characters with a defense into attack either Kaya's or mr. Big conversion kit so it's a ton of survivability and it is a ton of ass whooping that's about to happen right now. No more balance types. Get that nonsensical BS out of here. Because, well, foreshadowing. Just like Master Goro. I do not fail. Oh, it's going to be epic. Oh, it's going to be epic. Oh, it's going to be epic. <laughs> Until I get comboed. Get out of here, Psyche. Do something with your life. There you go. Good good demon. That's a good personal demon. Now, oh, let's go. Wow, 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 get it nameless. Wow, get it nameless, get it nameless, get it nameless, get it nameless. You got the... <laughs> you are ridiculous sometimes, Ryan. <laughs> Especially when you don't have to sweat too hard. Let's show his drill arm right now. This is a super from Nameless that is rarely seen because it's his five tier. And it looks amazing. Thought I'd just show that off real quick just because I'm very considerate. <laughs> Not to in game content, but to my subscribers. To my beloved subscribers, I am quite that. Like now, for instance. Ah, <laughs> uh, that girl just got drilled. <laughs> Stop that, Ryan. Uh, not very gentlemanly of you. <laughs> well, I'm sure that she would melt my face off if given the correct opportunity to do such. Come on, get on my left side so I can get better material with actually showing you get nameless combo. 
<laughs> uh, you see how considerate I am? I'm actively trying to put the boss on the left side so it looks a lot cooler when I do things like this. <laughs> That's so interesting because K99 had a very similar move, except it was a giant fleshy arm. And for uh, Nameless's traditional three tier, it looked like um, K99 uh, was shooting a shotgun, which is kind of interesting. So, just some FYI from your guy Senpai Rai about some ancient KOF actual in-game lore and uh, things of that nature. Put some DPS on him real fast, or her I should say, and oh no you guys, I got about 90 seconds left over, I hope I will be able to finish this, oh gee golly, <laughs> she might actually stand a chance. Five to your right, eh, well let's wait for it. Okay, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. <laughs> now we can do the five tier. <laughs> Anything else is uncivilized, everybody. A couple basics. Nope. Had you fooled. <laughs> Let's just end this, because it is brutal god project time. With or without Ignis. <laughs> uh, too much fun. Psyche, calm your ass down. <laughs> we get it. You win. If that wasn't completely obvious. There you go. Well played, sir. <laughs> now, we are officially on, what, tier... Move, King Cell! <laughs> tier 38. We are on tier 38. Here we go. <laughs> Let's keep moving. Tier 38. Hmm. As you see, Awaken Level 38... Fighter type, attack type. Oh lord. Oh well. lord. Five star geese. Griselda, as you guys see. <laughs> sure, why not? The way she's dressed, right under 60,000 CP. All the capsules in the world that would fit her for her five staredness. We have Seven. Lady Zero, with just under 50,000 CP at level 41 five star but it's okay because she's a lady zero does not matter does not matter does not matter now finally we have maxima and yesterday i just put out a video where i pulled a memory of this girl from a ticket to get her up to four staredness as well and as you see i capitalized on that but this dungeon calls for an attack team. Can anybody tell how much happiness I'm holding back right now? <laughs> Am I completely that transparent sometimes, everybody? Now, on the subject of Ready? Griselda, Go! I know that what I'm about to say next is going to confuse a bunch of my newer subscribers. But to my older subscribers, my subscribers that have been with me from about... 1500 subs down to like the very beginning i'm putting together a special project that's taking multiple days just like this but y'all love how i take special projects and effortlessly seemingly put them together like this one for instance this took place over the course of like four or five days just getting all this data together on these rhd runs now the project i'm referring to is I'm putting together a complete showcase. Now, I did get in trouble for putting these together because they are a little bit raw, and they are, I'm going to remind everybody, specifically for the fans of this channel. I do incorporate lore sometimes, but a lot of times, whenever I don't, it is a little bit raunchy, or violent, or a number of other things. Now I'm going to leave a link to um, one or two of my, again, showcases in the past if you were a newer viewer. And essentially what they are, it's what whatever character in question is a showcase, I come up with a voice for that character using all my own vo voices. And it's even crazier if they're, say, a lolly character or a female. Yeah, I'm not even joking. Like, these videos used to be the shit until um, both U YouTube and Universal... Um, disliked the way I handled my business on that and put me on a probationary period. 
so I can't monetize those videos, can't make any money off of them, but you wouldn't gut the Sistine Chapel, so I refuse to take them down. So, again, I will leave links to some of my showcase videos, and I am putting together one on Griselda, a Halloween special featuring the succubus known as Griselda. But in the meantime, we are on tier 39, so that's just something to look forward to everybody in the near future. Tier 39, boss stage. Everybody, this is the last boss I am going to put on this video for tier 39. As you see, you need a defense type when it comes to the fighters. I have Lady Big again as the leader. Now, everybody, presumably, since she has the defense by 50% increase, has either, again, a Kaya set or a Mr. Big set with a couple of defense cooldown cards because sometimes you gotta grab your knees and push yourself forward because that's how I roll <clears throat> apparently now let's just ace this tier and then after this tier we can go all back to guessing what tier I'm really on if I did something similar and climbed another two tiers off camera like I did last time I did an RHD run but that would put me at tier 41. Go. Presumably if I beat this. Presumably. <laughs> as long as they don't give me a balanced team, I'm sure that I could easily... Well, maybe not completely easily, but within a certain amount of um, restraint, beat these prior tiers. And again, what I did was I chilled out on tier 34 for about a week and a half. And from there, this is Psyche's 5 tier, by the way, if y'all were ever curious. And uh, after I cheer chilled out on tier 34, you saw when I did that run, I could damn near auto-battle the way through it. You know, but then my characters started getting hungrier, and they reached their max, and I started obtaining more memories, and they needed those tier 5 capsules. Luckily, I have the tier 1 through 5 boxes that come in every day thank christ for that but at this point it is only the tier 4 or the tier 5 capsules that do anything for me now you look like a giant golden armadillo mr beast let's okay now these bosses are a little bit harder than the other ones so i'm gonna try to get you on the left side but if i can't no love lost let me get you with this and five tier right now Give my other actors a chance to come back. And if they're not, then I'll do a couple basics to catch you out of the air. Okay, skill one, basic skill two, basic skill three, and pop wings. Now, one, two, three it is. <laughs> but again, you guys, um, in a previous run, I talked about how I was putting together a showcase on Griselda. That is exciting, because again, this has been the first showcase slash skit where... I have put it together in the past, like, probably since the Vice banner, where Vice and Mature were my last ones. I got in a little bit of trouble for that one, and, of course, I got in a lot of trouble from the Psyche one. I'll put a link to that one as well. <laughs> Ryan, what are you trying to do? Destroy your channel? Y you know what? If I don't get another single subscriber, it would hurt my feelings. It absolutely would. Five tier. But at the same time... I'm faithful that y'all either love the information I put out, y'all love my personality, or you love the specific content that I put out. And again, I will remind you, if you ever see, and dig, I have over 220 videos, if you ever see something with 100% showcase on it, if you have a strong mind and a good personality, I would highly advise you click on them to witness the madness. Because a lot of my showcases, nobody knows about my showcases unless you've been a fan for a while. For a while, of course. It's like at one point I wanted to bury them very deep so that people might forget about them. But I, I have people that have subscribed to me just because of the showcases that I do with the skits. But then again, I have had people unsubscribe to me for the same thing because they did not know what level madness truly existed within me. Now let's finish you off right now. Have fun coming since everybody's dead. Pop wings! And Ashley Crimson, the golden boy. Getting it done in the most epic way. Alright, let's cut the vid. Tier 40! <laughs> Imagine that. You didn't say no for a change, woman. Mm-hmm. <laughs>
two times in a row. I'm not going to press my luck by pressing your push button. Now, all that being said, this will comprise of, again, the tier 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, and 39 bosses in RHD. I have hoped that everybody has enjoyed this. And again, keep an eye out for an upcoming Halloween special showcase on everybody's favorite succubus. No. Yes, you are. You're a vampire, woman. You suck the life force from men. No. I'm sure that's what you tell them all before you do it as well. But yes, it will feature Lady Geese and her Mac showcase. And if you're new to my channel, I'm going to leave a couple of links to my showcases if you want to really be a G about my potential insanity just dig and look for anything that says 100 percent complete showcase to again hear how crazy i can potentially be or as imaginative as i can be because again remember you guys on a closing note the difference between madness and brilliance is measured by success so again i hope that y'all have enjoyed this rhd bosses only special teams run this has been your guys senpai rai and i'm out <laughs>